Hello, my name is Ron Arroyo, and I'm going to be teaching you how to export from Adobe Premiere. Alright, so first uh, we have a clip here, and it's all, it's all very nice and good, and it's done. So now we need to export. So first thing, we go to File. First we need to click on our, on our project, and Sequence 1, just uh, click on Sequence 1. Go to File, uh, Export, and Media. Now this should take you to a window here. It says Export Settings, and you just have to go through them one at a time. So, Export Settings. Uh, keep uh, Match Sequence Settings unselected. Format. Uh, just do whatever format you want it in, whatever it is. Uh, if you want only audio and not uh, visual, uh, say you want an mp3 file of a uh, of YouTube video, stuff like that. Uh, so you just go to mp3 if that's what you want. For for this, we, we're going to keep it a uh, quick time. Uh, presets, we're just going to keep it this. Uh, I like to keep it just uh, defaults most of the way. Uh, no comments. Output name, this is where you're going to set it, you know. Where are you going to save it in? So for me, I'm just going to save it here. I'm going to name it uh, Walker Furniture. And uh, pretty far. Uh, yeah. MOV. And save. Uh, make sure export video and export audio is uh, selected. The first time I um, the first time I exported from Adobe Premiere, uh, um, the export audio box was unselected. Therefore, I only got audio. I mean, I only got visual, and it was very hard to to figure out why. Uh, okay. This is just a summary. Okay. Uh, now here's where uh, I got very confused at the beginning. Uh, there's metadata. There's Q, export, and cancel. I would click export because uh, you know I went to file export. I want export it right. Uh, the trick is though to queue it. I believe it works if you if you put export it works but it takes a much longer time and it doesn't export it as well when you go to queue it opens up Adobe Encoder which should be popping up any say there we go Adobe Encoder CS6 Adobe Media Encoder CS6 Okay, once you have Adobe Media Encoder open, after you clicked Q in in the export setting windows, you go you have to go over to this one right here. Uh, make sure it's QuickTime. Make sure you have the same settings. Uh, just you know, double check everything here. It's just double checking. And just click the play button. And if I'm not mistaken, it should be encoding right now. See? Yeah. Okay, that should be uh, that should be it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and have a good day.